hey everyone hope you guys are doing well so i just decided randomly right now that i want to shoot a podcast i don't know what this is about but i'm just gonna dive deeper into my thoughts and just speak about what i feel you know i feel is relevant so i'm just out here thinking about the whole concept of life right so i'm realizing that myself i tend to gravitate to stress to being overwhelmed um to wanting to have power or have control over things i can't control um stressing stressing about the past um worrying about what could have what could and yeah that that results me into not fully enjoying the moment right i have times where i enjoy the present moment um <clears throat> especially when i'm with my family my friends my partner like people that make life life you know but when i'm alone that thing hits me and i just tend to overthink and worry so much so i don't know why but for some reason i'm a person who is very much interested in knowing the human brain the mind the human behavior behavior and everything that makes something what it is so i always go deeper in like when i look at something i want to understand the stem first before making a conclusion or judging that and i i i i found i, I find that so healing i think that helps even with this podcast thing me sharing that it actually helps me like with what i'm with what i'm dealing with the stress the overwhelming you know and all those things but what i wanted to say is that like you know it's a i've i've found through communicating with people you know having conversation i'm realizing that it's a human thing it's a human thing um yeah i think our experiences as human beings make us who we are um the the past doesn't define you but it definitely makes you the person that you are it makes you view things a certain way so you sometimes when you especially me sometimes when i overthink or overstress about something it would be because i was in the same situation so or the outcome of the situation made me stressed so hence i was stressed about that thing so i always try to find stuff to make me not um overthink in that moment or during that um process so what i usually do would be to breathe or meditate or work out yeah or just sleep it off but sometimes it gets uncomfortable it you become stressed and then to a point where you're like i can't just deal with this thing that's when i start i start praying but what i'm trying to say is that it's a human thing to worry it's it's okay to worry it's actually okay to worry about um things to be anxious to be overwhelmed you know and you just need to know when to take a break from something and remind yourself also at times that you are only a human being having ex- an experience at the end of the day we are all going to die we are going to leave this earth and it's just going to be that you going i'm going to be a memory i'm going to be a history i'm going to be forgotten you know so i always tell like that always comes to my mind also like i'm like i'm worrying so much about something that <laughs> in the next uh i don't know how many years i'm not going to be here like i'm literally not going to be here you know so 
try find joy in the in the moments you know although sometimes it's not it's not easy but it's it's a constant thing you know with life me in fact let me just, like this is what life is i'm describing life i think i'm going to call this um part life in bold letters in capital letters i mean like <laughs> life has just a uh, life is 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 full of surprises it has an a, a weird way of <clears throat> showing itself and a lot of things that are happening in my life i'm realizing that i have control over them some i don't have control over them and that's fine those that i have control over i should control them those that i don't have control over i should let them go you know and um remember to pour into your own cup um a lot of times as i'm i'm a giver so i tend to give so much to a point where i forget myself you know and now i'm realizing with i need to start giving into myself as much as i give to people more than anything else i need to start pouring into my own cup i need to feel my cup like i really need to do that and it starts with the small things you know buying myself gifts um knowing when to let go of things you know i i feel like also now that now when i talk about something like something else i feel like sometimes um when we talk about self care or putting yourself first the first thing that comes to your to our mind or my mind is materialistic things and i'm asking myself now i'm in a point where i'm asking myself that okay why does it have to be materialistic things well the society has made it to be materialistic things so that's what we think i don't know but now i'm i'm a, i'm in a point where i'm thinking that not everything has to be associated with materialistic things because what happens when the materialistic things materialistic things are not there i'm not going to be happy i'm not going to be content so i'm not going to feel good about myself so i try i always try to not um view things at materialistic things you know and I, i i try to find joy happiness love um peace contentment self care from within and i think that's the most um i think that's the most amazing thing or one of the it's it's rare it's bold it's rich it's one of the richest thing that a person can possess you know in a world where everything is just rushing and everything but just find what you're looking for from within i think that's the most authentic thing one can do and yeah i always try to do that yo yeah i've spoken a lot i hope i make sense um i have plans i have plans guys for 2025 i have plans for 2025 i just hope everything will go well um even if it doesn't it's okay you know, the timing <clears throat> is not right but yeah for now i just want to say that the the concept of life can never be understood by anyone but you define life in your own terms and everyone can come up with their opinions on what they want to say what life is but you define what life is for me i can i i don't have the exact words to describe what life is but i feel life is a beautiful thing it's a human experience it's your i think life is meaningfulness and meaningfulness in everything everything and life is an it is, is an educator it teaches you things like everything that you 
<laughs> oh now that i'm thinking about it i'm thinking we see life is coming is it's not coming at you it's not okay how do i want to put this ish guys i'm i'm studying ne? i'm studying in english so you can imagine what is is in i'm busy studying big words like youngsters so hence the thing by the maybe that's why because i've been reading a lot okay like i'm trying to say that <sighs> oh my god okay bali relax <sighs> okay life is coming uh life is making life for you um life is coming for you not against you life is working for, no you know what i'm trying to say i'm trying to say that life is working for you not against you so trust the process trust the higher power trust the universe trust yourself more than anything else trust your instinct if your instinct is telling you not to do something don't do it if your instinct is telling you that you need to do something do it so more than anything else the instinct is the most powerful thing that you can have i think once you start listening to your instinct then gee and you must remember we as people are energies don't go into rooms where your energy will not be appreciated go to rooms where your energy will be appreciated if you know that those people don't like you don't hang around with them if you know that those people didn't like you what will make them like you now you understand people show themselves true colors and now your energy tells you that here i can be here this i can't do this i need to do so more than anything else believe in yourself because no one is going to believe in you believe in yourself like attract that believe in you because no one else is going to believe in you value yourself put yourself first take care of yourself i said a lot especially on the last few parts um i will try to also dissect those topics because i feel like energies instincts um what else putting yourself first those are the three different topics i can dissect so we're going to look into them probably whenever i feel like it whenever the day comes when i want to talk about that so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this podcast by the way i enjoy podcasting <laughs> i enjoy podcasting i wish i had a mic you know or a mic like this and then sitting on a couch and then just talking you know with you guys about anything and then having tea because i love tea so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this one and bye